The Dry Andes Spanish, Andes Arados, is a climatic and glaciological subregion of the Andes. Together with the Wet Andes it is one of the two subregions of the Argentine and Chilean Andes. The Dry Andes runs from the Atacama Desert in northern Chile and Argentina south to a latitude of 35 degrees south in Chile. In Argentina the Dry Andes reaches 40 degrees south due to the leeward effect of the Andes. According to Luis Labutri, the Dry Andes can be defined by the distribution of penitentis. The southernmost well-developed penitentis are found on Lannan Volcano. <laughs> Paleogeography, paleoclimatology and paleoglaciology Though precipitation increases with the height, there are semi-arid conditions in the nearly 7,000 meters feet towering mountains of the Andes. This dry steppe climate is considered to be of the subtropic type at 32 to 34 degrees south in the valley bottoms only dwarf scrubs grow. The largest glaciers, e.g. the Plomo Glacier and the Horquins Glacier, do not reach 10 kilometers miles in length the ice thickness is not very significant. During glacial times however, c. 20,000 years ago, the glaciers were over 10 times longer. On the east side of this section of the Mendoza Andes they flowed down to 2,060 meters 6 feet and on the west side to sea, 1,220 meters 4, feet. The massifs of Cerro Aconcagua 6,962 meters 22,841 feet, Cerro Tupungato 6,550 meters 21,490 feet and Nevado Juncal 6,110 meters 20,050 feet are situated deca kilometers away from each other and were connected by a joint ice stream network. Its dendritic glacier arms, i.e. components of valley glaciers, were up to 112.5 kilometers (69.9 miles) long, over 1250 meters (4100 feet) thick and spanned a vertical distance of 5150 meters (16900 feet). The climatic glacier snowline Ella was lowered from the current 4600 meters (15100 feet) to 3200 meters (10500 feet) during glacial times. Topic References <references>